Growing up in the United States, I had a lot of black and African American people to look up to. Whether they were a part of pop culture, music, sports, or innovation, it's impossible to ignore African American history when talking about American history. In this series on my channel, I will dedicate videos to some of the people that inspired me the most. Happy Black History Month. She was born James Zeta Hawkins in 1938. Some people called her Miss Peaches. Others say she is the mother of R&B. We know her as the legendary singer Etta James. She sang as a child, starting voice lessons at the age of five. She sang in the choir, church, and on the radio. By the time she was 12, she'd moved to San Francisco to sing at a trio. Soon after that, she began to work with band leader Johnny Otis. By 1954, she had recorded her hit, The Wallflower, with Otis's band. That's when James Zeta Hawkins became Etta James, and her trio was called The Peaches. By 1960, her career was in full takeoff mode, with hits including I'd Rather Go Blind and At Last. And despite years of substance abuse problems, James sang into her 70s. Etta James won six Grammy Awards and is in the Grammy Hall of Fame. These video documentaries were pulled from the YouTube page KISS 104 FM. I discovered them while doing some research and I figured I'd give them a shout out and share their content of because of how well they were done. So make sure you also subscribe to their channel and like this and share it to your friends.